We care about our overseas K-pop fans. And this is a segment catering to our foreign viewers. Who want to know more about the language and culture of their favorite singers, it's time for Reading, reading the, the lyrics. lyrics. Joining us again is our Lyrics Fairy, Ellie. Hey, Ellie. Hello, everyone. This is your Lyrics Fairy, Ellie, right here. Today, we'll focus on an idol star who has been dubbed the flawless artist idol because of her excellent songwriting and music producing skills. Mm, okay. Then who is it? It's IU. Oh, IU has definitely written a lot of great songs. And for me, personally, I especially love her lyrics. I love her lyrics too. Perhaps it's because IU invests a lot more time and energy into writing the lyrics than the music. When she feels like the music and the lyrics don't go well together, she decides to change the melody to better suit the words. That's why her lyrics are so good. But Ellie, you must have had a hard time choosing just one song from IU because they're all so amazing. Yes, I had a really tough time and it was also hard for me to pick just one expression to teach our Pops viewers. I mean, I wanted to go over the entire song. Well, what song did you ultimately choose? Announce it to us. It's the English title of which is Friday. Friday. Did you know that this song climbs up the music charts whenever Friday rolls around? It's insane, considering it was released all the way back in 2013. Well, did you have a special reason for selecting this song? Of course. I wanted to awaken the love cells in our viewers' bodies. It's a sweet romantic song that teaches you how to do a bit of milbang or push and pull, which basically means playing hard again. Ah, milbang. Yes. Friday is about a woman who makes all sorts of excuses to not see the guy she's seeing until Friday. Then why does she want to see the guy on Friday? Well, she thinks they'll probably be busy on Monday. She doesn't say she wants to see him on Tuesday because she fears she'll seem impatient and desperate. She thinks Wednesday being right in the middle of the week isn't the best time. She simply doesn't want to see him on Thursday and she can't wait until the weekend. That's why. And I just want to say I mentioned the word I'm about to teach you guys today. Oh, I know. Are they the days of the week? Monday is 월요일, Tuesday is 화요일, Wednesday is 수요일, Thursday is 목요일, Friday is 금요일, Saturday is 토요일, and Sunday is 일요일. Mm -hmm. I'm sure our pop family already knows that. Then what is it? It's 성급해 보인다, which is the reason she doesn't want to see the guy on Tuesday. Sangupada can mean a number of different things, like impatient, hasty, or rash, depending on the context. And since it's sangupe boinda, not sangupada, it means that it looks or seems that way, right? Exactly, that's right. So sangupe boinda means that someone looks impatient or seems to do something too quickly. The lyrics actually go sangupe boiji angure. Why don't you explain to our viewers what 안 그래 means? Sure. 안 그래 means no, it's not. But here, it is used as a question form. So it's like asking, won't well, I seem impatient? No. We also use the same expression in English. And that's it for today's Reading the Lyrics. Bye! Wait, 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 wait a minute. You're being 성급해. Exactly, that's right. This is the perfect situation to use the expression 성급해 or 성급하다. Let's try to come up with a few more examples for our viewers. Let's say that your friend was working too hastily and made a mistake. Or your friend wants to find a job ASAP but is having trouble. Then you can comfort him by saying 너무 성급하게 생각하지 마. Which literally means, don't think it needs to be done so quickly. But basically, it means no need to rush yourself. It might be a bit difficult to apply, but don't be too quick to give up. 
너무 성급하게 포기하지 마. If you think it's a bit hard to nonce, um, how about practicing it while streaming this segment, reading the lyrics again, or listening to IU's Friday? All right, then I'll see you next week. Not Friday, but Wednesday. 수요일에 만나요. Yes, yes, it's time for me to say goodbye, but don't be too quick to change the channel. 성급하게 채널 돌리지 마세요. And stay with Sam until the end. Oh, nice one, Ellie. Good job. And I can't wait to see you have in store for us next week. Until the day when all the K-pop fans around the world don't need a translator to understand their favorite songs, we'll do our best on... Reading the lyrics. Bye-bye.